Hey guys, it's Pavel here from Emersoft and today I want to talk about the latest feature from HubSpot and OpenAI. Now you can connect ChatGPT directly with your CRM. I will show you how to integrate two platforms, analyze your data and get actionable insights from your CRM. HubSpot is a powerful platform and the amount of data it holds can be overwhelming at times, especially if you manage big sales teams. Without spending hours digging through reports is very easy to miss key opportunities. Now with the connection with ChatGPT, it can analyze the data for you. GPT will help you spot patterns and identify area of improvements. Hey guys, what this guy is saying is really important. He's doing a very deep dive, step by step, how to connect ChatGPT and your HubSpot. So stick until the very, very end because what I've seen is really mind blowing and I use HubSpot every single day in our business. And obviously if I use something, I would love for your, for your business to have the same thing and to use that as well. So stay tuned. Okay, let's get into it. I'm here inside of my chat GPT. And the first thing that we need to do is to open the new chat and click that plus button and you can click the deep research. Now you can select sources and if you go to connect more, you will be able to find HubSpot here. So you just need to click on the HubSpot icon and hit connect. It will ask you for all the permissions. You don't need to be worried about it because everything here is taken care of on the enterprise grade level. So you click to connect to HubSpot, paste my code here hit connect and then it asks you to connect the account. I select my account, choose account, connect the app. Now my HubSpot account is connected with ChatGPT and we can start playing with that. If you want to allow your users to use the GPT connection with your HubSpot account, you would need to go to settings and select the GPT connection, go to action, go to settings and then click that button on the top right to give users access. Once you do that, they will be able to use the HubSpot connection with their own GPT accounts. Let's also talk about the data privacy in your chat GPT account. So if you are on enterprise teams or educational plan, your data by default is not being used by OpenAI to train models. If you are on plus or pro, you have the ability to opt out from sharing the data to improve models. If you haven't done this before, I would recommend going to your settings and then go to data controls, prove the model for everyone and just opt out if you haven't done this. And now you can be sure that your data is not being shared with OpenAI to improve their models. Once the connection is ready and you reviewed your data privacy policy, we can start playing with the HubSpot and GPT connection. A lot of our customers or people we talk to often feel like they are not using HubSpot to its full potential and are not taking advantage of all the features that they're paying for. This is actually a great starting point for our HubSpot and GPT deep research integration. We can ask GPT to review our data, review our setup and give us recommendations on what could be done better, what are the underused tools and how to leverage them more to get the most out of our subscription. Let's start. First of all, we need to select the deep research here and you want to make sure that the HubSpot connection is enabled. And, and now I prepared a simple prompt that would give us some initial insights on our HubSpot setup and to see if they have, if it has any recommendations for us. In this case, I got some questions from the AI to perform better research on my account. Okay. I prepared some answers for the AI and, uh, explained my situation a little bit more. And let's see what it has for me. Uh, the deep research is going to take around 10 minutes. Another cool thing that I recommend looking at is the prompt library from HubSpot, where you can find all the different propositions, ideas, and inspirations that you can use for your HubSpot and GPT connection to identify different uh, improvements or analyze your data. You have the filter here, you can select the hub, you can uh, select the prompt type, 
and use cases. I really recommend going through this and uh, reviewing that. Maybe you can find something interesting for yourself and your company. And I'm sure that the connection with uh, AI and your HubSpot will be very beneficial for your organization. It's a game changer. I've been using this daily and it already gave me a tons of insights and uh, actions that uh, I'm going through. Okay, after seven minutes, we get a tons of insights and recommendations that we can go through. It's a block of text, but that was the that was the idea. But now, after reviewing this, we can go to the next use case. Let's go back to the library and see what we can get from there. In my case, I would like to work a little bit more on the marketing hub. And I found this interesting prompt. So I will just copy it. I will create a new chat and uh, let's select the uh, deep research. My HubSpot connection is enabled and I just paste the prompt that I got from HubSpot. I got some follow-up questions again from GPT to better understand my situation. Let's go for them. I drafted some answers for the AI and let's uh, run our deep research. We got some results back after six minutes of deep research. Uh, I can go for this. I see that it was looking for some information online. You can see, you can find all the sources on the right hand side. Some of those informations are coming directly from my HubSpot account. So even here I can see that uh, it found the, the email that I was sending to one of my customers and things like that. So it's really relevant to the current situation, your current HubSpot setup. And you can go for this. We have the drip ready. Uh, it returned the HTML for my emails as I requested. I can go for this. I can see what it, uh, what it recommended. And of course, this is a still chat. So I can ask follow-up questions. I can say, okay, maybe let's do it that way, this way. And just like that, with this GPT and HubSpot connection, you have a consultant at your fingerprints. You can talk to them. Right now, the feature is read only so it can read your HubSpot data and give you insights on this data. I can imagine in the future they will be doing actions as well. So GPT will actually be able to make updates in your CRM, maybe add some fields to your contacts or maybe update deals or maybe just enrich your data further. In my opinion, that connection is a game changer because we work with a lot of uh, HubSpot clients and I can see firsthand how bloated are some of those CRMs. There's tons of data and it's so difficult to actually use it. But now with the GPT connection, you can ask AI to analyze the data, give you insights and, and then help you with some inspiration how to utilize this data to increase the revenue save your time and set up maybe more automations and actually spot things that you don't use in your HubSpot that, that you're paying for. So this is a great feature. Let me know what are the biggest CRM headaches in your organization. Drop them in the comments and I see you in the next one.